I'm Storm Trekker 18 meteorologist Jess Langlois. A beautiful start to the weekend today. We didn't quite hit 70 degrees in Eau Claire, but we got very close today. We did hit 70 in Red Wing, the Twin Cities, but some upper 60s throughout the area today. Medford even up into 62. So regardless of the fact that we didn't quite make it to 70, it was still a gorgeous day and we're expecting more of that as we go into Sunday. So as we first head into the overnight hours tonight, we'll see temperatures falling You're out to around 40 degrees overnight, so not getting too chilly overnight, right around average for this time of year. And then quickly we'll see temperatures pick back up as we head into the day on Sunday. But in terms of those showers, we did see some throughout the area earlier today, but as we were starting to lose that daylight, we'll quickly see those showers diminishing overnight tonight, and we will start the evening mostly clear, so not a lot of cloud cover. Could be partly cloudy by Sunday morning, but overall expecting pleasant weather, especially for the first part of Sunday. Getting into Sunday afternoon, we could once again see some of those light pop-up showers, but chances are looking lower tomorrow than they were today, and the best chance likely south of Eau Claire to see one of those but again, they'll be very light and scattered in nature. Not all day. Not everyone's going to see them for the most part. Looking at another mostly sunny, warm, pleasant day on Sunday. Going into Monday is a little bit different. We'll see this more widespread line of showers moving through. So the, a little bit better chance to see some of that on Monday morning. Can't rule out some rumbles of thunder embedded with that as well. Before we do see some clearing and going into Monday evening before another round of shower and thunderstorm chances moves through for Tuesday. So tonight we're looking at 40s, partly cloudy, so near average lows for this time of year. And then tomorrow, mostly sunny, can't rule out a few of those pop up showers or a couple rumbles of thunder in the afternoon. But again, looking at pretty minimal chances. And if we do see them, they'll likely be south of Eau Claire. And for the rest of the upcoming week, a little bit more likely to see some precipitation on Monday and Tuesday. So that those showers could be heavy at times and going into Tuesday, especially we could see some of those embedded rumbles of thunder. Going into Wednesday, we'll start to see a little bit more dry air moving in, so we will see those chances diminishing. Temperatures in the upper 50s, some 60s return for the second half of the week with some sunshine as we head into May and going into the first weekend of May. Slight chance for some showers, but overall temperatures still hanging into those upper 60s. Not looking at 70s quite yet, but we will be close on several days.